Hey, what's up guys? My name is Charlie. Today we're going to be watching some board games. This is going to be episode 19 and it's going to be some dream phone. So uh, yeah, let's check out the video, shall we? Let's go. We're living life here. Stock market. Taxes due. I just got married. Ooh, payday. Ah. All right, you forfeit your turn again. Run for mayor. All right. Mayor, you as mayor? Ski accident, pay $5,000. Payday. Baby boy. Stop having so many kids, you fucking asshole. Buy books and supplies, pay $5,000. I already did that shit 10 years ago in college. You have a college degree? Bioengineer. I win! All right, guys, well, that was fun. What do you want to play next? I got a game. Dream phone. Are you kidding me? But this is a girl's game. This is for a little girl. That's a bunch of hogwash. You guys are a bunch of wiseacres, huh? This is a great game. Trust me on this. Trust me. If that's what you want. All right. We're going to play Dream Phone. <laughs> All right. So the goal of the game is to figure out which one of these hunky guys likes you. Hi. I just heard. It's not Steve. I know where he hangs out. He's not at the beach. He'll eat almost anything, except pizza. Hello. I know who it is, but I'm not telling. Huh? <laughs> Fuck you. Mm. Fuck you, you piece of fucking shit. <laughs> First player who guesses their secret admirer wins the game. Mom says hang up. Oh, drop dead, Pootsie. He looks cool in whatever he wears. He's not wearing a jacket. I'm gonna guess Gary. All right, I think I'm going to guess who it is. You're right. I really like you. <laughs> I win. You know, whatever. You guys have to admit, pretty fun game. Well, I would hate to admit it, because it's such like a girl game, but it actually is pretty intense. Who would have thought this game would be so awesome? <laughs> Forget that it's targeted towards young girls. It plays like a detective game. You really got to think. Like, imagine if it's the same exact game, same rules and everything, but instead of trying to find a guy who likes you, it's all about solving a murder case. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it's kind of like Clue, actually. Mm. Yeah, like, um, like, uh, Candyland. Mm. No. No. <laughs> I'm gonna go home, all right, guys? Just gotta get going here. Before you go, I would like you to have this game. <laughs> I don't need it. I have plenty of games at home. Uh, so. it'd be, it would look great in your collection. Yeah, you I should insist. take it. You're a girly girl. <laughs> yeah, you girly girl. Yeah, you girly girl. Plus, I got like 15 of these at home, and you'd be really getting it out of my hair. Really? <laughs> I insist. Yeah. Take it. It's on me. Thank me later. I will. Okay? Bootsy, Bootsy, Bootsy. Hello? Oh, hi. That's weird. It's weird. You can hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. Good evening. Who is this? <laughs> I'm just a secret admirer. I really like you. Not a real phone. 
time. Hmm. Hello? Hi. Please don't hang up. I just want to get to know you. That's Look, all. Look, I don't know how you're doing this, but it's gotta stop, okay? It's not funny anymore. Hey, I'm just a normal guy. We have a lot in common. I'm sure we could play some board games together. You like board games, right? Sure. What's your favorite board game? Cut it out. Hey, please, don't hang up. We could talk about movies. I see you're watching Night of the Living Dead. You see what? That's a good, scary movie. You hear it, of course. You <laughs> must really know your movies. I like that hat you're wearing. What hat? Come on, what's on my hat? Thundercats. Oh! This is a scream movie scene here. Hell. <laughs> we needed some popcorn in the background. That motherfucker. <laughs> you hung up on me again. You can't keep doing that. You're gonna hurt my feelings. I get lonely all the time. Go ahead, call your friend. <laughs> it's like a game. This is fun. Hey, Mike, come to the window. What are you trying to prove here, James? Okay. Hey, did I'm you here. hear? It's not Mike. What is it? Nothing. Never mind. Hang up on me again. I'm going to rip your intestines out and hang them from the ceiling. How you doing, James? Hey, Bootsy. What are you up to? Eh, nothing. Just twiddling my thumbs. Doing nothing, huh? You want to come over? Really? Yeah, play some Boggle, Super Mario Brothers. Or some Twister? Do you like breakdancing? Or cheesy, maybe? Yeah, come over. I bet you can get over here pretty fast from wherever you are. Yeah, well, I don't know if you heard. I got my dick bit off by a shark last week, so uh, <laughs> I'll try to speed walk. Might take me All right, a few. I'll see you. Where is he? Bootsy? Bootsy? Please, no jump scare. Not again. <laughs> <gasps> oh, shit! <laughs> Oh well, he's dead. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Listen, I'm gonna call the police right now. You're gonna call the police when you have a dead body in the house? Who do you think's gonna get the blame? They'll trace the call or something. They'll find you. <laughs> trace what? What are you gonna tell them? You got a call from a toy phone from a girl's game? <laughs> what do you want from me? I just want to play a game. Who are you? Tell you what, we'll make it a guessing game. You can ask me anything you want, as long as it's a yes or no question. Okay. 
Are you in the house? Yes. Who the hell are you? That's not a yes or no question. Drop dead, Bootsy. Are you Mike? What? You call him and find out. <laughs> Mike, you better get over here right now. It's a real emergency this time. Oh, no. Is this what I think it is? No, it's not like last time. The bucket. I never touched the damn thing since. Uh, <laughs> all right. I'll, I'll be right there. All right. Okay. Look in the closet. Closet. Jesus fucking Christ! He's dead! D <laughs> did you kill him? No. Did you? No. Well, he's dead. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 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 Where are you? That's not a yes or no question. Fuck off. Am I getting warmer? You're already warm. Trust me. <laughs> Fuck off are you? Come on, who am I? Take a guess. You know who I am, say my name. In fact, I'll give you a hint. I'm closer than you think. I've been watching you all night. I'm gonna fuck you so hard, steam's gonna come out of your ears and your eyeballs are gonna come popping out of your fucking skull. Who am I? Say my name, motherfucker. I'm gonna grab your skull and gnaw your fucking face off like a motherfucking rat. Take a guess. If you have the balls. And I know you have the balls. Mr. Bucket? Is that him? It... That was a hint. That's got to be Mr. Bucket calling. That's not him, is it? <laughs> you can do better than that. Hmm. Yeah. You can see me right now? Huh? Yes. Well, then what am I doing right now? Flipping the bird. That's not a yes or no question. Then tell me right now, where the fuck are you? <laughs> <laughs> you can't see me now, you demented fucker. <laughs> no, I can't. I can't see those gorgeous flowers on your head. Boy, <laughs> does that make you look fantastic. I'm in the closet. How can you see me? Well, you sure got a hold on me. Fucking hell, you piece of shit! <laughs> 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 
shit, I'll kick your asterisk, you hot pink piece of shit. You always want me to hit pound? Well, here's your fucking pound. One nine hundred. Fuck you. Dial the operator. I'll show you how my fucking fist operates. <laughs> 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 That was absolutely creepy on a whole new level. He is really doing a good job at creeping me out. That that was just, I mean, the phone was good and everything, but that ending was just creepy. Well, uh, he must have, he must have, I don't know, why do I have a feeling that he killed him all along? I don't know, I just feel like he all along... It, he, he, I don't know, he killed Bootsy or something, I don't know, I just feel it, like he was the deranged one, because it's a, it's a good plot twist, that's what I would do if I was writing a story, all along, it was him, and, I mean, it's the only explanation, I mean, buckets, talking phones, obviously has some sort of, uh, some form of schizophrenia, dementia, or whatever, um, some sort of hallucinated, uh, hallucinations that makes him crazy, um, stuck in another reality in his head, doesn't perceive things correctly, oh, I don't know, obviously there's something up with that, I'm very interested, I'm very hooked, so yeah, let's, um, end the video here, if you like this video, make sure to give a like, comment down below, and make sure to subscribe to my channel if you enjoy my content, I'll see you guys on the next episode, peace. <laughs>